The ACLID Conflict Alert System, CAST, is a global prediction tool that forecasts the number of political violence events that will occur each month for the next six months in every country around the world. Specifically, the tool predicts ACLID battles, explosions slash remote violence, and violence against civilians event types at the country and first administrative division level, i.e. province, in addition to producing an overall global forecast. New predictions are published each month for the following six months alongside accuracy metrics for previous forecasts. In this demonstration, we'll be touring the ACLED CAST dashboard. You can access the dashboard from the ACLED access portal or through the CAST landing page on our website. In both cases, you'll be required to log into your access portal account to use the CAST tool. This is the CAST dashboard. This demo will walk you through the main sections of the tool beginning with the forecasts. By default, this tab shows the global forecast for the present month, displaying an aggregated count of all events and disaggregated counts by event type. You will also notice a predicted change column, which indicates if the number of events is increasing, decreasing, or staying the same relative to the average number of events per month. Increases are indicated by a red arrow up and decreases by a yellow arrow down, matching the colors displayed above the map. An orange line indicates a limited change in the number of events compared to the average. If a country or administrative division is shaded in gray on the map, this indicates that it is excluded from the dashboard results because it has too few events per month on average. Shifting over to the map, the default display will provide a global overview. The shading corresponds to the predicted change from the average using the same predicted change color coding. Moving to the table on the right hand side, we have all the countries covered by the tool. The model analyzes every country covered by ACLED, but only displays results for countries with more than five events per month on average. In this table, you can sort or filter by country the number of forecasted events, the average historical number of events, and the percentage change from the average that the predicted events represent. The bottom chart shows the historical event counts as well as the events that ACLED is predicting. To control these timeframes and variables, we look to the filters on the left-hand menu. Here, you will also find instructions on the dashboard, including references for the thresholds. You can filter by country, event type, and comparison range. The default comparison range is the last 12-month average compared to the upcoming month of predictions. This is what determines the average value for the predicted change statistic. CAST can forecast out as far as six months. Each month, we rerun the numbers to increase the accuracy of the prediction based on the latest information gathered. In the What's Driving the Forecast section, users can see which indicators contributed most significantly to a country or administrative division's forecast. If we filter on Admin 1, you will see that the graphic in this section changes to show how our model arrived at the number of events that are forecasted. It shows how many events each indicator contributed to the total predicted event count. On the top right-hand side, you will find the glossary for the terms used in the tool. We will now move on to the Accuracy Metrics tab, which provides further detail about the accuracy of cast predictions. On the map, you will see the mean percentage error, which is set to the average over the past six months by default. Using the top filters, you can see how past cast predictions performed by country, outcome, and time period. The mean error indicates, on average, how far off the actual number of political violence events the prediction tool was in the forecast. The mean percentage error represents the mean error as a percentage of the average number of events in that country or administrative division. You can toggle between seeing these two values displayed on the map. Lower on the page, you will find further information regarding the accuracy metrics and definitions for the terms used in this section. On the right-hand side, you will see another chart displaying the same data. You can also sort your results by clicking on the headings on the table, such as sorting by mean forecast, mean error, etc. This table is helpful for visualizing the mean error in number of events and the mean percentage error side by side. If your use case involves looking at a highly active conflict with a large average number of events, the mean percentage error may be helpful in order to contextualize a large mean error term. The mean error may be hundreds of events, but it only represents a small percentage of the number of events that area typically sees. Similarly, in some countries that have seen few events in the past months, being off by a single event can cause over a 25% error in the prediction tool. In this case, the mean error may be a more informative statistic. If you're interested in downloading the CAST predictions, there's a button available on the CAST landing page on ACLED's website, which will allow users to export the predictions as an Excel file. The results are also available via an API. Users can also engage with our free-to-access interactive report, which highlights key CAST predictions every month on the landing page.
If you're interested in further details around the methodology behind the CAST predictions, you can also find a comprehensive methodology document at the landing page as well. Please note that every registered ACLED user has 10 free accesses of the CAST tool, including downloads of its predictions. If you require further access, we ask that you reach out to our access team outlining your intended use of the data. We'll be happy to discuss the available options for extending your access. This concludes our ACLED CAST demo. More information regarding the tool can be found at the CAST landing page on ACLED's website.